Hello Java developers, my name is Matt Rabel and today I'd like to show you how to use the Okta CLI to create a new account, create a Spring Boot app, and register with Okta as an OIDC app so you can actually authenticate into it. Let's get started. You can find instructions for how to install the Okta CLI at cli.okta.com, Mac OS instructions, Windows, and Linux. There's also a GitHub repo at Okta slash Okta CLI. Also has instructions there and of course you can always just pipe it to bash if you want. The cool thing about the Okta CLI is it's written in Java made to work on all OS's with Graal VM and most of its tests are done in Groovy. So let's get started with a terminal window. I'll bump up the fonts a bit and do Okta start spring boot. So it prompts me to register a new account. If you already have one you can just type Okta login. And this will create a brand new organization for me, register my account, send me a one-time password, and then it'll also register that Spring Boot app, download a GitHub repo that has a Spring Boot app in it, and configure it all for me in just a matter of seconds. So now I can check my email for that code, paste it in there, and then you can see it created this new Okta domain for me, and it prompts me to change my password. So I can open that up, type in a new password. So it resets it and it logs me in. If I were to go to applications, you'd see that it actually created that Okta Spring Boot sample for me and my ID and secret and everything's in there using authorization code flow. So now I can CD into Spring Boot and I can run it with MVN Spring Boot Run. And then if I go to localhost 8080, I should already be logged in. So you can see it spits out my username and that code that renders that. If we do tree on this directory, we'll see where all the files are in application. So source main Java, source main Java. This file has the code that returns that username. So I hope you've enjoyed this quick demo of the Okta CLI and Spring Boot. And I look forward to sharing much more information about Okta and Spring Boot with you in the future. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and have a nice day.